I'm here with Michael Fox. We're here at the Dream Team Media Day for Seth Mitchell for his fight coming up June 22nd against Jonathan Banks. That's to be the rematch for that fight. But another side of Beltway Boxing is the side of the amateur. And I'm with a guy right now who decided to hold off on the amateur red and focus on his, his education, Michael Fox. Tell us about that, the transition. I had high school. I had to get I had to get that out of the way. I had to make I had to make sure that was handled before before I, before I pursued this career. Like in the long run, I want to go professional. I want to be a professional boxer. But I'm saying I'm gonna remain an amateur to make a statement nationally. Making a statement nationally. It's gonna progress my professional career when I decide to make the switch. So that was the reason for you staying out of the ring because you wanted to definitely focus on your education in high school. Yeah, I, I stayed out. I stayed out of the ring, but I was never out of the gym. Okay, you stayed in the gym, but you stayed out of competition. I stayed, yes, I stayed out of competition. My last fight was in November. That was my first open fight. I had one open fight, um, and I had that fight. But then my father told me, like, you just finish high school. My father, my father and coach, he told me finish high school. We're gonna go at. We're gonna go at this right. Who is, which is Troy Fox, by the way. And we and we said we're gonna do we're gonna do this right. We're not gonna we're not gonna we're not gonna half, half we're not gonna do it halfway. So basically, it was just so you can be so, solely focused on boxing completely. Yeah, totally, I had to be totally focused. That was, all, that was what it all was for. I actually I, I missed the competition. I, I missed it. I'm ready to get back into it. Uh, the pals coming up and I told them I'm ready to do that. Uh, right right now, I want to make a statement of that. So, so my so my name so my name will ring bells. So how, when do you think you'll be back into the ring as an amateur? Well, like I said, the pile in October, but any shows between then and now, that that, that all that actually is going to help me. So I want to I'd like to get into some of the shows, the local shows. And then then that'll help me when I when I go to get to the tournament. How old are you now? 17. Okay, so 17, you still got a little more time to develop as an amateur, and then when you turn 18, 19, maybe, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing you'll be in your maybe 20, 20s when you turn pro maybe, yeah. give you some time to be in the amateur ring, give you some some, some ring experience, yep. give you some rounds. Yeah, that should be it, and then yeah, probably, maybe, probably around 20 like you said. There you have it, a person focused on education before he uses boxing, and to become a professional. Michael Fox.